What's up guys, coming at you with another top lane commentary. We're playing York in the top lane up against Kale. Kale is a pretty easy matchup for York, not gonna lie. I'm not worried about this one. The thing about Kale is, yeah, she can poke you early. She doesn't have Klepto anymore, so it's not as bad as it used to be. But, um, she's really easy to just capture and kill with, uh, your W. So, uh, that's where we're gonna go for this game. We do have to respect her early on, though, because her poke is much stronger than ours. We just, we, as with... Pretty much every matchup with York, you have to chill early on. Let yourself get pushed in. It also keeps you safe so you don't have to waste your ward, too. So. Slitter. Farm up. I'm perfectly fine trading this farm here. Now, if you didn't know, Kale, when she hits level 6, uh, becomes a ranged champion. It used to be level 11. I changed that to make it laning less horrible for Kale. Once we get 4 ghouls here, we can look to trade. Nice. She loses this now. Yeah, she loses this big. I ran back in because I saw the minion dying, and I was like, oh yeah, we can turn this around on her. You also notice that uh, the ghouls proc conquer too, so they're the ghouls uh, scale off York's AD, so conquer giving me more AD makes them do more damage. And we can just keep doing this on to kill on repeat. Uh, she can't really deal with it very well. I'm going to wait for a fourth ghoul. It's around jungle time, so i got to be careful with this Predator Ramus. Oh, no. I put two points in my Q. I could have got Flash. Dang it. I fat-fingered my level up, and I was supposed to get W. If I got the W, I could have got her Flash there. She is so low, man. She's dead if she gets caught. I see uh, Nidalee fighting. Yeah, Kale has to go back here. We can just freeze. Let's try to stop her back. Okay. Now Kale can go back if she wants. She dies up in a big lane like this. Oh. That's fine, because she's losing a ton of CS up here. Like, this is a big freeze on her right now. That's why she came up, because she's just missing so much. I gotta clear these minions, though, because uh, I will get pushed in. Yep, here it comes. Alright, finally got my W. W's like the key against Kale. She can't get out of it. The wall. Surprised that Kale isn't teleporting. That's a big mistake not to teleport. That's why I've been trimming, because she should be teleporting here to get this uh, minions, because uh, more and more are going to die. So, before she gets walks all the way back up here. Just gonna lose a cannon minion here, it's great. She only has 10 CS, so we're doing really well against her right now. I'm gonna clear some minions, because, yep, she's coming and I want to fight her. Yeah, I missed my E, can't go in. Now we're gonna get pushed in, that's unfortunate. Okay, she's warding. Keeping Kale in a vulnerable position is exactly what we want to do here. I just can't hit that E on her, man. I need to wait for her to, uh, like, last hit an obvious minion. There we go. Now we have her flash here. Or do we? Uh, I can kill her. Damn. Maybe I really can dive. I, I can't push this up, so I really has to dive. Nice. She ignited her. I don't think she needed to ignite her, but you can. Oh, actually, you're you're too low. Never mind. I was gonna say help me push, but you're too low. Oh, yeah, she didn't teleport before. 
smart of that guy not to help me push. It was a bad call. Or we could just go back now. Yeah, so I got Kale's flash earlier. You guys saw one W. She has to flash. She's pretty screwed. So now she'll have her ultimate, so that sucks. But uh, she'll she'll be forced to use it when we trap her again. It's it's easy kills. Get uh, the fade here so we can run her down. Uh, control ward, sure. I'll even grab a read GB because we're going to want to go T-Bot this game. It's a good game for just split pushing. She can't stop me. All right, we're losing Dragon. Aerialy definitely needs to give this up. No way we can stop that. Oh, wait, well, we've got uh, Nidalee here, but who are we missing? We're missing our support, so it's pretty dangerous, yeah. Ah, uh, she's going for the steal. Couldn't quite get it. Oh, that's a, that is so bad of that Nidalee. I don't know why she did that. It was clearly gone. Very uh, poorly played by that Nidalee. Need to spawn some ghouls here. See if we can force her ult out. Yeah, we just run her down. We didn't even have to flash. That's how easy it is, guys, with York. Super hard counter to kill. Gotta push fast because she doesn't have her TP. Go for a plate here. Uh, no, let's actually just push in the next wave. I'll get the demolish proc, but I don't think we'll get it. The, uh, plate. Oh, you know what? Gotta back off. I don't want to lose my maiden. I got minion blocked. That might screw me. Yeah, it screwed me. Damn. Uh, I got minion blocked there, and it, like, made me sidestep for a second instead of getting out of there. So my maiden dies. That sucks. Could have placed my ward. There's a Tommy's. I have Ramus. I'm gonna get the Merc Treads because I just feel like the CC is gonna be super annoying this game. Between a three second taunt, a slow, a snare, sometimes a slow from him, it, it's just kind of annoying. Ninja Tabi is better against Kale uh, because obviously she's very auto attack reliant, but uh, I don't sense any threat from this Kale. We're dominating her. The only thing that could save her now is Ramus, so. I'm going to place our control ward here. Make sure we always have a ward here before we overextend. I'm fine with Kale just pushing to me, though, because I don't want to fight without my ult. York's really weak without his ult. Get our wards down, because, you know, we got a Predator Ramus, so you definitely want to get a deep ward out there. You'll be coming in fast. Keep walking to avoid her Q. Yep, Ramus is top. Don't know why Ramus is up here though, because I'm getting pushed in, so it's a misplay from that Ramus to go to a, for a gank that he can never get. I can hardly help with this. I'm coming. We 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 have to give that up. Uh, why do you keep trying, dude? Oh my god. It's so bad that Nidalee's just like trolling me so hard. Uh, that She's one shot. Ramus clearly is dominant there. Okay, and she rage quits in a ranked game. You can't make this stuff up. These type of players, man. You don't know how to play Nidalee jungle, just don't pick it. How about that? Well, not having a jungler is going to be pretty rough. I'm going to have Smite. Got two plates here. It's pretty good. Ramus mid. Maybe I rally and I can carry. I don't know. I'm just going to try to create problems up here for this kill. Grab this to help run her down.
For help, man. No one can help you. You're the only AF kid. <laughs> Don't have a jungler anymore, so. I can start taking her red and stuff, actually. No, Ramus took it. Please, I need help. Okay. Maybe after I kill this guy, I can go help. Good bone plating mitigation there. Okay. Almost killed her there. You guys saw me walking with her. It's smart of me to walk that way. That's like orb walking with your opponent. So wherever she goes, I go. Make sure she uh, dies if uh, she doesn't flash. She has no ult. Rambus is probably up here. Super greedy of me. Rambus is bought. I can push this. Great. I have to make big, big plays like this because we're 4v5, so it's important for me to take advantage of whatever I can. Gotta give up my bait in here so we can get plates. We have to pressure. No other way. Damn. Zed's top. We have to take risks like that. Good, really good on us to take a risk like that. Have to. I should consider putting more points in my W to keep her here. Oh my god. That was so bad because I keep missing my E's, dude. Should be able to go for Rift Herald after this, see if we can keep making plays. We have to keep taking these risks or we just straight up lose without a jungler. Rambus is up here. Yeah, you're dead, buddy. Oh shit, that said kicked her ass. I better be careful. And Kale can come. Yes, of course it'll be left. I was <laughs> just seeing this. I don't need the red actually because uh, I have theirs. We're not even losing right now. It's 9 to 9. I'm gonna teleport back to lane here. Man. Ever solo split. 
J with support. This guy, no, it's not Zyra's fault, it's his fault for going off on his own like an idiot. Zed, Zed's waiting for shit like that, it's so common. How easy this is. Kale's just not even a champion compared to me. I just destroyed this guy. Uh, just get kited. Missed my E there too. I didn't have any ghouls. My team has a 4, 4v3 or 4v2. They should be taking this, but... Yeah, there you go. Come on, someone has to be here by now. Hmm. Nice. Wow, that one auto-attack did so much damage. Could consider going for that, too. I need a Steric so I can uh, 1v2 properly. The team mods just so I can get quickly into the towers. I think she outplays that. Uh, she doesn't have her Q. Ooh. Okay. Bane has full HP. She needs to be there. Yeah, there's kill. Kill weak. I'm gonna go for the red buff now. Yeah, back off. Oh, you gotta dodge that, dude. I thought not hit that. She wins this. I'm coming. Uh, he he's just gonna dash away. I think I want to go for the Rift Herald here. I can kill everybody here. Jesus, that's the rank one York right there. Actually, I'm going to come over here. This looks like Vayne isn't helping. <laughs> He'll feed in York alphabet soup. That's a quadra kill. God, I love York so much. People don't understand how overpowered this champion is. I really want that Rift Herald soon. I got 3k gold, so I don't want to fight. Why are you going in, I really? Oh, I guess Baron's up, so we can't... Very dumb of Irelia to do that. I'm going to try to pressure this one with teams here. I want to get uh, ghouls pushing this side lane. Back off. Damn, my whole team is dying, dude. Eh, he had to flash there, I would have killed him. He had dead man's plate now, so I could chase these people. Fortunately, I can't really split push because my team gets keeps getting caught. Yeah, you better not back there, buddy. I'm coming. Yeah, he's just gone. I can't do anything about that flash. I don't want to fight this guy.
Yeah, I, I can't 3v1 like that. It's just stupid. Sorry guys for the lack of commentary, I really have to like tell these guys what to do. This vein should never be splitting because it takes her like 8 years to split push a lane. I should be the one split pushing. She doesn't have any wave clearing abilities. Ramus is dead, I mean, we could try, but... Let me... Okay, he's bought, let's... Uh, yeah. We have to fight this. Uh, I don't have ult. Yeah. Hmm, why'd she back off? We can fight this. Back off. Back off. Uh, you're going in when I... Mm. Keep over fighting. Just trying to get the side lane pushing and letting the enemy team know that I'm up here. We do not want this fight. Uh, I'm I'm actually like weaker when my team groups and tries to help me out. I really need to be solo splitting. I have teleport. It's the best I can do. Oh, we got this. I have my ult up too, so... Man, this Irela keeps overdoing it. Does she need help? Killer. Perfect. I knew she was gonna flash that vein like fucked up and pushed her into the wall. Go for the infernal dragon here. Oh no. The flash miss. I really should have her though. Yeah, we kill the Ramus if he comes. start typing it all caps now. Back. Hell yeah, dude. About to 45 this. I have some armor now, so I'm not so scared of the Zed. This lethality gets countered here. I didn't have any armor before. I saw Ramus down here, so I don't want to get baited. And I get baited.
Ugh, should have waited and let my team push. They need to be taking inhibitor for that, though. They set three bots, so it should be really easy. Three bot. Senna just backed. They need to back off after this. Oh. Yeah, they're dead. I really missed her combo there. She might be able to live. Wow, she one-shotted the Ramus. Kale split pushing. See if we can do anything about that. Go for a uh, Titanic Hydra now. It scales off health and gives us a more... Or the damage of the Titanic Hydra active scales off health and we have a lot of HP, so that'll be good. I can't 1v3 like that because I just get hard CC and kited out. That's like York's problem. And if you get kited, the only thing you can do to counter that is to get land your E on someone and let your ghouls do the work for you. But unfortunately, I landed my E on Senna and I was only able to auto attack the Zed. So the damage there was really split up and not very well placed. I don't know who else is here. I don't think we have Baron anymore. Yeah, we could group bot. I agree. We only need one more for the... Uh, we only need one more for the uh, Dragon Soul. Yeah, we don't need to be pushing me. Oh, no. Ramus. She keeps getting caught. I'm coming. Run to us. Nice. Good job. We'll get here just in time. Okay, she's out. Okay, these guys are like super fast-paced champions. Okay, he flashed. Find us. Kill him. There we go. Hey, Vayne with the end? Nice. And my ghouls are helping push the lane. GG, 45. Plus 50. Well, that's how you play rank one York style, man. The York, he's just such a strong champion. You guys saw that quadra kill I had earlier. Normally with York, you want to get your split push going on and try to get that side lane action. But um, we had to play differently because it's a 4v5. So we had to do our best there to try to affect the game as much as we can, support these guys because they needed help. So we had to be the jungler in some instances and go help out our team. But uh, yeah, you, even with York, you can still win 4v5. So, And hey, we just hit promos. For our bronze to uh, diamond, we just are in gold four promos, so that's awesome. Number one, York. <laughs> Thank you. Damn, one LP away from promos. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. That was a really fun game. I mean, uh, like I was saying, York easily counters Kales, just destroys her. So I got really fed off that, and I was able to help out my team quite a bit along with uh, the other two carries. We all did very well together. Let's see the graph. Awesome. So we, by far, like, we're super far ahead. We were able to carry these guys, so they got to the late game point where they're finally able to start doing damage. So that's really good. Full damage to turrets, too. Did great damage to turrets as well. So that was really fun. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that game. Uh, it's really exciting winning those 4v5s. And, yeah, that's some uh, York gameplay for you. That's why I'm main York. I'm really good at York. Call myself the rank one York. <laughs> All right, see you guys next time. I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the